What is happening guys? My name is Alex and welcome to a new video. It is Wednesday as it means a new Sony Vegas tutorial for you guys and in today's video I'm going to show you guys how to You see what just happened? I'm going to explain to you guys how to stop crashes, freezes while rendering, editing when you're dragging in footage. Um, so it drives me insane. I don't know what the problem is when I'm editing. I'm just like really into the editing and then boom, the screen turns white and then I'm fucked. Okay, so the thing you want to do to prevent this, um, the first thing is what I experienced myself is you do not want to drag in your footage. So let's say you have like a really busy project and in here you want to drag in another file. Let's say, let's say my thumbnail. Just imagine that this is like a really heavy like 1080p 60 fps Canon 600D footage, uh, like really heavy, like two gigabytes. Drag that into your Vegas and normally it loads like two seconds but sometimes it just crashes. It keeps loading and once you click like this, it turns white, then the icon starts uh, loading. Basically, your Vegas crashed. So the first thing I'm gonna show you guys like to do is never drag in your footage from the folder directly into your timeline because it can freeze while putting in the footage because I experienced this myself. The best way to import footage is you wanna click on, just on, click on file. You just wanna click on import media and pick your footage from here. Like this, boom, Eleni Halko. You just want to put it right this and just put this place it this one and boom there you have it you want to drag in your footage that way so this is the first way so the second way is a little bit more like settings related so i'm going to show you guys um, what to do to be able to stop um, those crashes so the first thing you want to do is you want to just kind of, you want to go to options and this is really important before you click on preferences you want to hold control and hold shift you want to hold those two buttons click it and then release it. Then you see this menu. You want to go over to the interval tab and you want to type in down below, you want to type in enable multi or just enable mo only when you see this. Okay, so as you can see default, it is true. As you can see, this is true, but we want to set this to false. Just type in in caps lock false and just press an okay. Now that's it for that section. Okay, so the next thing you want to do is you want to go back to options and this time you don't want to hold control and shift. Just press on preferences and you want to pick the tab video. Okay, and then this menu pops up and you need to do exactly what I do to in order to fix it and manage to do this correctly. So we can go down to a GPU acceleration of video processing. This is normally like your graphics card. You want to put this one to off. When that's done, just press on apply and press on okay. And the next thing you want to fix is just in the render setting so in order to do this you need to place something like video in so you can render it so click on file render as and as you can see this render menu pops up you want to go to the tab which says sony avc mvc blah 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 and you want to go for internet 1080p 30p this one you want to just click on customize templates and you want to choose render using cpu only I'm gonna press an OK, and now you can start rendering. So that's how simple it is, guys. Just do those settings, and I think it will not completely remove the, the crashes because you never know. Um, but just also don't like run like extreme heavy programs um, like in the background when you're editing with Vegas because it might crash. I don't know. It depends on what kind of things you have open on your on your computer. So make sure all heavy programs are closed and that Sony Vegas can take the full space of your CPU and RAM to render properly. That's it for this video, guys. So if you want to see more of the Sony Vegas tutorials every Wednesday at 12 p.m. PST, that's 9 p.m. CET, make sure to subscribe down below if you find this video helpful. Make sure to smash that like button down below. So I want to thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next week. So until then, I'll see you guys very soon. I don't want to tell too much about it yet. About this topic, like how to drive a car easily in general. We're back with a new review. No, so we're back with a new series. Today we're going to review the GeForce 210 video card, so enjoy the rest of the video. So let's read some of the specs. I'm just going to tell you guys what the new schedule looks like and how it goes and all the stuff. So, okay. Thank you guys very much for watching this video, and I'll see you guys in the next video.